Hey guys, it's Imani. Welcome back to my channel. Or if you're new here, then welcome to my channel. And as promised, I'm back with another styling video. This time with an Indian twist. So last week I had styled a plain black satin slip dress in different ways to create some western outfits. Today I'm going to style the same dress with some desi tadka to create some beautiful Indian ethnic and fusion looks. I've created all these looks keeping in mind the ongoing festive season and they are super wearable. So I hope you enjoy watching this video and find it helpful. Please share and give a thumbs up if you do. Also please consider subscribing to my channel if you haven't already by hitting that red subscribe button down below, bell button for regular notifications and yeah let's get started. For the first look, I'm gonna pair my slip dress with a patiala salwar. I'm using this plain black one, but you can experiment with different colors and patterns. And now throw on a nice colorful Gujarati jacket on top. I'm using the same Kulkari jacket that I had featured in my Navratri outfits video a couple of years back. And accessorizing with this beautiful chunky silver neck piece and a pair of jhumkis. Also completed the look with a red clutch bag and these juttis. Juttis go really well with patiala salwars. Now let's create a beautiful lehenga look using this dress. I'm using this very pretty flary lehenga which is plain with just a border. And now I'm going to drape this matching dupatta with it. Just take one side of the dupatta on your shoulder like this and from the other side tuck one corner in the lehenga. You can accessorize this outfit depending on the occasion but I am keeping it simple with just these earrings embroidered chappals, some bangles and a super cute portly. For a more hands-free version of this look, pleat the dupatta like this. Place on your shoulder and secure it with a belt. I'm using this gorgeous pearl belt and absolutely love the outfit. For the next look, I'm taking a puff sleeve top and layering it under my slip dress. Since my slip dress is black, I've taken a black top featuring these beautiful organza sleeves and an asymmetric choker neckline. And now pair a sari with this. I've chosen this beautiful chiffon sari that my mom gifted me. Drape it in the regular style with pleats tucked in the petticoat. Now pleat the pallu as well and make it fall at the front like a Gujju style drape. And we are all set with a stunning Indo Western outfit. As for the accessories, I am using these statement animal print earrings, a nice shoulder bag and black pumps. This is such a fun classy look and is surely going to turn some heads. Pair your slip dress with palazzo pants for a very simple yet pretty look. These are the same pants that I had styled in 10 different ways in one of my videos. And now I'm just simply throwing on this beautiful pink dupatta. You can carry the dupatta in any way you want, accessorize with some nice oxidized silver jewelry, strappy sandals, and you're all set for a light function, dinner party or puja. Now I'm gonna 
wear a black sheer bodysuit under my slip dress to create an all black outfit. It's a mock neck top with full sleeves. And now adding this black maxi skirt under the dress. It's a beautiful flary skirt with silver border. As for the accessories, they play a very important part in this look. So layer some chunky silver neck pieces, earrings, and I'm completing this look with the same embroidered chappers and this colorful embroidered clutch. And that's a wrap. I hope you enjoyed watching this video and found it helpful. Please share and give a thumbs up if you did. And do let me know in the comment section below which of these styles was your favorite. If you try out any of these styles and post your pictures on Instagram, do tag me and I'll happily repost your pictures on my Insta stories. And if you like my videos, please consider subscribing to my channel by either hitting that red subscribe button down below or by clicking on my picture in this small circle over here. Also hit the bell notification button to get regular notifications every time I upload a new video. And yeah, thank you so much for watching. Have a great festive season and I'll see you later. Bye.